Now, the shooting was about 3 o'clock this morning over on Alderson Street in Cloverleaf. Now, Shelby Rose is there um, with what deputies are able to piece together this early in the investigation, Shelby. Yes, good morning. You know, Sheriff Ed Gonzalez is out here on scene and says it does appear to be a targeted shooting, although we do not know if that 12 year old boy was the intended target. Hear me behind me. It's still a very active scene. This only taking place a few hours ago. It's that corner apartment unit right there with that red tape around. That's the apartment that we're talking about. It was around 3 o'clock when Sheriff Gonzalez says a suspect allegedly walked up to the unit, went to the window, and started firing. We don't know how many shots they fired, but at least one hit that 12 year old boy who was sleeping in bed. There were other children also in the bed, a six and seven year old girls who weren't hit. Thankfully, their mother and another man were also inside the apartment at the time, also unharmed. But unfortunately, that boy was pronounced dead here on scene. Uh, anytime it involves a child, it just hurts a little bit more. It's it just heartbreaking. I'm just thinking that this child would probably be getting ready for school uh, very soon um, and uh, unfortunately that that's not going to happen. And right now we don't have any suspect information, hardly any at all. The only reason why Sheriff Ed Gonzalez says it appears to be a targeted shooting by the manner of which it happened. He says that it does. They don't think that it was a drive by shooting. That the suspect actually walked up and fired those shots. He does say that they are going to be checking area businesses. We're standing in front of a barbecue. There's also another convenience store to check if they have video because right now all he was able to tell us is that they allegedly fled in a pickup truck. We don't know make, model or color, but hopefully as the morning goes on, and we'll get some more information. Reporting live in Cloverleaf, Shelby Rose, Fox 26 News.